together every day, having adventures as we play. Up in the hills, down on the beach, always a rainbow within reach. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, yeah. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, come on. Hello. to say hello 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 let's stop to say hello it's a way to say we're glad you're here come on and say hello hello hedgehog hello fox hello pig hello monkey when friends are near we smile and say hello when friends are far we wave and say hello it's a friendly word that shows we care come on and say hello hello mr frog hello hello, hello mr. mr goose hello hello friend Hello. Hello. Hi. Nice to see you. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> this song is about colors. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Yes, we do. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Now take two. Mix two colors and you'll make something new. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Yes, we do. You can also add a little bit of black or white. Yeah! <laughs> it's so good to see you again. The rest of the gang is already here. Let's see what Pig is up to. Hi, Pig. What are you painting? Can you tell what it is? A green apple. That's right! Let's see if you can guess what my other paintings are. What's this? That's Mr. Frog. <laughs> yes! And what's this? Hmm... It looks like a green airplane. That's right! What's this one? That's a green pumpkin. They're usually orange, but I wanted to paint a green one. Did you notice something about all my paintings? Look again. I painted a green apple, Mr. Frog, a green airplane, and a green pumpkin. What do they all have in common? They're all green. That's right! Today, I'm only painting green things. Pig's paintings give me an idea. Let's make green our special color of the day. colors like the color green.
Which snake is green? There it is! Green snake. Which fan is green? There it is! Green fan. Which gift is green? There it is! Green gift. Which jewel is green? There it is! Green jewel. That's exactly right! Pig, Fox, I'm going to show you a new way of painting. Mm. Um, I don't see any paint brushes. That's right, Fox. We're not going to paint with paint brushes. Huh? Huh? We're going to paint with sponges. Ready to see what happens? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Do you want to start with blue paper or red paper? Blue, please. And I'll take red, please. Great. Now, pick up a sponge. Dip it in the yellow paint. <laughs> and start painting. Oh, 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 look. My paper is turning orange. Because red and yellow make orange. My paper is turning green! That's right! <gasps> Look how smooth it looks! I'm tapping my sponge. <laughs> it looks rough, like, like rocks. Smooth and rough are textures. Say it after me. Textures. Textures! textures. I'm done! Me too! Let's hang up your paintings and look at them. What's something that's the same about your paintings? We both painted with sponges. That's right. What else? We both painted with yellow. Yes. And what's something different about your paintings? Mine came out green. And Pig's is orange. And my painting is rough, but Fox's is smooth. That's right. Now, what do we do when we're done painting? We go play. Uh-huh. But first... We clean up. Oh, right. That's right. Let's clean up together. Okay. okay. It's story time! Yay! Get around, everyone! What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called Drivers in a Hurry. This book is about different kinds of vehicles. Let's read it. Let's begin. Drivers in a Hurry. Written by Chow Chinith. Translated by Alicia Berger. In a warehouse, a bicycle starts its journey. Ticka, 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 ticka. A pedicab starts its journey. Ticka, 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 ticka. A motorbike starts its journey. Bup, 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 bup. A three-wheeled scooter starts its journey. Bup, 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 bup. A car starts its journey. I am in a hurry. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Grung, grung. A bus starts its journey. I am in a hurry. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Grung, grung. A train is also in a hurry. Clickety-clack, clickety-clack. Get out of the way, get out of the way. Papak, papak. Watch out, 
Watch out! Crash! The drivers start to cry. They realize that they had forgotten something important. We need to install traffic lights. Let's do it together. Our traffic lights are ready. When we see the red light, we must stop. When we see the yellow light, we must slow down. When we see the green light, we can go on. We will obey the traffic laws and we won't crash. The End Thank you, Mr. Goose! Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, Mr. Frog. I'm going to teach you a song called Five Little Monkeys. Ooh, monkeys like me. That's right. Today, we'll all pretend to be monkeys. Just like you. Yay! <laughs> I'll sing the first part, and then you sing along with me. How many monkeys did I say there were? Five! Good listening. Here we go. Five little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped its head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. <laughs> now I want you to all sing along with me. I want to hear you sing too. Let's count how many monkeys there are. One, two, three, four. Four, four little, little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped its head. Mama called the doctor and said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Now how many monkeys are there? One, two, three. Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Let's count how many are left. One, two. Two, two little, little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped its head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. How many are left? One. One little monkey jumping on the bed. It fell off and bumped its head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. That's the song. Well done. Yay! Thank you for singing with me. You too. Thank you, Mr. Frog. Goodbye. Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Hey, everybody. Let's practice our letters by playing the alphabet game. Yay! I want to hear you, too. Let's all play the alphabet game. When I show you a letter, say its name. Are you ready? Yeah! What's this letter? M! What's this letter? N! What's this letter? W! What's this letter? Z! Now let's do it fast! M-N-W-Z-N-W-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z-M-Z
<laughs> Mr. Goose, can we trace a letter? Absolutely. Let's practice making the letter M. Who can think of a fun way to do it? I know! Let's trace letters with a glue stick! Well, that sounds like a great idea. Fox, why don't you go first? Okay! Great! I'll try it! <laughs> M! Ah. Terrific tracing! Now, let's trace the lowercase letter. I'll trace the next one. Hmm. M. Nice job. I want to try. <laughs> You did it! Let's look at the letters we made. What's this letter? M! Exactly! Uppercase M. And what's this letter? M! That's right! Lowercase M. Nice job! Wow! Wow! Cool! Nice work, everybody! Thank you, Mr. Goose! M! And now, it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye, it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, let's stop to say goodbye. Before we say hello again, we need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye! Bye! Goodbye! <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, its fleece was white as snow. And everywhere that Mary went, Mary went, Mary went Everywhere that Mary went The Lamb was sure to go
Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb. Its fleece was white as snow.